There was no need to overreact. Victor Wimbanyama took over in his second summer league game in Las Vegas on Sunday night. Though it wasn't quite enough to lead the San Antonio Spurs to the win, the Portland Trail Blazers won 85-80 at the Thomas and Mack Center, the French Phenom looked so much more comfortable on the court. Wimbanyama dropped 27 points and had 12 rebounds and 3 blocks. He shot 9 of 14 from the field, and 2 of 4 from behind the arc. The Spurs took Wimbanyama with the number one overall pick in the NBA draft last month, which made him the first ever number one overall pick from France. The 7 foot 4 center has long been touted as the best NBA prospect since LeBron James. He's coming off an international season where he was named the French LNB Pro A League MVP after leading the league in points, rebounds, and blocks. When Banyama was thrust into the spotlight immediately upon arrival in Las Vegas, even getting into a bit of a controversy with pop star Britney Spears. His debut on Friday was just the second time a summer league session was sold out ahead of time, and NBA legends like Jerry West and Kareem Abdul-Jabbar were in attendance. ESPN kept showing live look-ins of Wimbanyama warming up during the game ahead of his, too. Yet, Wimbanyama's debut was a little disappointing. He scored just 9 points with 8 rebounds and 5 blocks. He shot 2 of 13 from the field, which is about 15%. Sunday, however, was very different. When Banyama got off to a slow start once again, but so did everyone on the court. The Trail Blazers took a 19-8 lead after the first quarter. When Banyama, after missing a pair of free throws, then hit a mid-range jumper to get on the board early in the quarter. It wasn't until the second quarter that when Banyama finally looked comfortable. He finished the half with 11 points, easily surpassing his points total from Friday, and had little issue dominating the floor. There was one sequence where he came up with a block on one end and then quickly threw down a dunk on the other. He also came up with a ridiculous putback slam through a Trail Blazers defender. When Banyama carried that over into the second half, and even flexed a bit after putting back his own miss through Trail Blazers center Ibu Baji while drawing a foul. When Banyama added 6 points in the third quarter, though the Spurs entered the final break trailing by 14. The Spurs then mounted a huge comeback in the fourth quarter, capped by a Wimbanyama three-pointer just under the two-minute mark to cut the game back to a single point. But that was as close as they got. The Trail Blazers held on to take the five-point win, which brought both teams to a 1-1 record in Summer League. Dominic Barlow added 17 points for the Spurs in the loss. Blake Wesley finished with 14 points. Those two, along with Wimbanyama, were the only Spurs players to score in double figures. Michael DeVoe led the Trail Blazers with 29 points while shooting 10 of 17 from the field. Jabba, 